Yo, what's up, everyone? Bricks Boy here, back with another video, and in today's video, we're going to be taking a look at some of my custom minifigs from Deadpool and Wolverine. Shout out to Super Spongy Skylar, Alex Planetary Brooks, and Ori's Boy 2007 for suggesting these customs. I've waited a while to, to make Deadpool Wolverine customs because I wanted to, I didn't want to spoil it for my viewers, and yeah, I, there were like a lot of crazy cameos and stuff like that. The film was an absolute blast. So, yeah, without further ado, let's jump right into it. First off, is Deadpool. This is just the official figure from 2012, no changes made. It's just the perfect custom. I know it is pretty valuable, but this is the best we can get in LEGO form. Now we can move on to our next character, who is, of course, I tell you, but it does rhyme with Wolverine. Here is main universe Wolverine. His hair is Doctor Strange's from Nowhere Home and Mortal Kombat Man, and the head and torso are his from the mech. I had to replace the arms with the ones from Wonder Woman from the MDC CMS series. And then his hands are some plain dark blue ones. The legs are from the CMS series of being Samurai Fighter, though with some yellow hips. And then he's holding his claws as an accessory. Here is Cassandra Nova, who I did make in a Deadpool villains video, but I decided to make her again here. Her hair is Mary and Ravenwood from Indiana Jones. And that's also a friend of Mad Eye movie from the Virtual um, Republic CMS series. Her legs are from the CMS and then she's holding a ring as an accessory. Here is Paradox. His hair and torso are Ben Yorick's from The Daily Beagle. That face print is kind of from the Lego Batman movie. His legs are some Ken Batman ones, but they were placed the hips with a lot of Chief O'Hara from the Lego Batman movie. Here is Happy Hogan. His hair is from General Zod from the Lego Batman movie, and the face print is Dr. Stranger from Lower Animal More, but some animal. This also print is from a Lego Agents figure that they replaced the hands with flesh on, and then his legs are some Ken Black ones. And here is Short King Wolverine. The hair and head are from X97 Wolverine from CMS, and then it's also the same black one where they will take the answer to one from Vacation Batman from the Lego Batman movie. His legs are some plain black king size ones, and then he's holding a scroll as an accessory. Here is Human Talk. The hair is for Kaiser from Age of Ultron, and the face print is in terms of what Captain America works perfectly because there's no pay back for seven. I know that head is in a trophy spot, but I still kind of works. That's also when it's from a man's warrior fighter, then it takes the arm with some dark blue ones and some flesh colored hands. His legs are some dual molded blue and brown ones from the Lego Store with normal position, and then he's holding the accessories of Fire Star from the Daily Bugle. Here is Electra. Her hair is Ms. Marvel's from 2017, and then the face print is Sabine Man. The daughter print is um, Wanda Maximoff from Endgame, then they're replacing on from Echo. The legs are Star Lord from Endgame, and then she's holding a blade as an accessory. I wish I had another one of those pieces, but I only have one in my collection. Here is Blade. The hair is from Sam Wilson, Captain America, and then his head and um, back attachment and um, katanas are his for the daily Eagle. The first print is from the Tie Fighter Planet, that replaces arms and hands with the ones from the CMS from 1999, and then his legs are Black Widow from the um, 2020 Avengers set. Know how long I've been waiting for this? Woo, I'm about to make a name for myself here! Yeah. <laughs> here is Gambit. His hair is from the Zombie Hunter Spider-Man figure, and the face print is Captain America's from the Avengers Punjab or the Avengers Tower. The actual print is from the Imposter from the CMS series 26. I do replace the hands from the black ones. The legs are from that same series from the Arctic Explorer. I do replace the hips from the black ones. And then I built him a custom start as an accessory using two grey bars and a light in the hill. Rounding off the Fox Avengers, here we have X-23. Her hair and torso are America Chavez's from Doctor Strange and Mortal Madness, and then her head and her hands are from a Hermione Granger figure. Her claws are Wolverine ones, and then she's using the legs from the CMS series Pony Green Magar. Finally is Nice Pool. The hair is from Tassie Beach. I wish it wasn't brown, like from Qui Gon Jinn, but I don't have it in my collection. And the face print is from an Indiana Jones figure. It's also a Shang-Chi style backwards. They replace the arms with the ones from Black Widow from the Avengers 2020 set and some red, color, red hands. And then his legs are from the integrated suit Spider Man. So yeah, that is the end of today's showcase. So, if you did, leave a like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more awesome LEGO videos. Goodbye.